Hey my legion, how y'all doing? I'm back with a snack review. And I just, uh, a little while ago, I just watched another episode of America's Test Kitchens. My favorite cooking show on PBS, and they did like a thing on soups, like a Italian wedding soup and a lentil and chorizo soup and a taste of chicken broth. Tasting of chicken broth. And I love the show. I think it's a fantastic show. I gave that a 10 out of 10. And let's get to the snack review. I got another thing from my haul at the Meadville Dollar Tree a while back. Now, I haven't done a snack review in a little bit. And it's a chip review. And this is actually something unusual. I got also got chip clips from there. I, I, I'm using them with the green one right now. But three of these decent size quality chip clips for a dollar is not bad. And this is what I have right here. These are called Glories. Not Gloria, Glories right there. And these are all natural kettle style cooked sea salt sweet potato chips. Made for sweet potatoes. And GMO free and gluten free, good health, natural foods. This was a dollar. It's a small bag, and not a bad size bag. Uh, 2.75 ounces. That's not bad for a dollar. And uh, it's made in uh, Greenboro, North Carolina. Because I remember being in North Carolina a long time ago in Fort Bragg. And uh, it has a giant story on the back, which I'll probably read after review. I'm not going to go into that right now, but it's a big story. And it's pretty interesting. And, you know, it says Glory's uh, Good Health Natural Foods. Glory's a Good For You chip that's gloriously delicious. And these are supposed to be Good Health Natural uh, food, food items. Okay, so let's give this a shot. Kettle cooked sweet potato chips with uh, sea salt. Oh, wow, here we go. I can tear the side on this. Yeah, okay. Wow, I didn't want to open that way. Right away, you get a good blast of uh, sweet potato. What they look like. Hmm. Get a couple more. Wow. If any, I just taste a hint of sea salt. But these taste like regular sweet potato chips, just with a, a slightly bigger crunch to them. They're okay. Not bad for what they are. I give them a, a very mild 7 out of 10 for glory sea salt sweet potato chips. I might as well go ahead and read the story on the back. It says, Welcome to the taste that was born and bred in the South. Our southern grown sweet potatoes are harvested, sliced, lightly settled, uh, lightly seasoned. And kettle cooked for a chip that's naturally uh, nutritious and 100% mouth watering, down home delicious, with no trans fat and low sodium. These GMO free and gluten free crunchy chips are sure to become one of your favorites. I like sweet potatoes, but. And the ones I had the sweet potato chips are only so-so. Not as good as a regular chip. You may not know that in addition to a full array of traditional nutrients, sweet potatoes are also high levels of root storage proteins with antioxidants that provide unique health benefits. The sweet potato has also been classified as an anti-diabetic food. That's cool. With studies that link sweet potato consumption to stabilize blood sugar levels and lower insulin resistance. Maybe the sweet potato should be named the super potato. I, I agree with that. So whether you're Connecticut Yankee or Southern Bell, you're about to experience glorious snacking that puts the accent on great taste and good health. So, and you go in there and I had a little thing at the bottom that said, good health, natural foods. Why sell for ordinary when you can experience the extraordinary? So like I said, these are okay. A very mild 7 out of 10 for these. And there you have for Glory's Kettle Cooked sweet potato chips with some sea salt in there. So until next time, bye please. Take care of my legion. Oh, and something else is going on. Usually, uh, you know, you take out the garbage Wednesday night and they pick up Thursday. Some haven't. They, they haven't picked up the garbage yet and some people are asking what's going on. I don't know. I mean, it's, it's bright out. It's still cold out, but it snowed a, uh, snowed a decent amount yesterday, but I don't know. 
Hopefully they'll take. I mean, I don't think they take it out Saturday or Sunday. So hopefully they'll they'll pick it up Monday morning. I'm hoping. So till next time, everybody. Please take care, my legion. Oh, and stay tuned for a cool pizza review later tonight, which will be the pizza I made for my dad and myself. So take care, everybody.